Lucid Motors has just revealed their proprietary battery technology. For more than a decade, the business has been improving on this technology. But this wasn't just another interview. There's a fully-fledged series dedicated to the technology that makes the Lucid Air. As part of a new YouTube series, the startup is sharing a peek behind its premium leather curtain, explaining its unique and, in some instances, industry-leading innovations. The first episode of the 10-part series titled Tech Talks premiered this week with Lucid Motors CEO and CTO Peter Rawlinson talking about battery packs and electric vehicles. In today's video, we'll go over all of the key technical information in the Tech Talk video. So, stay tuned. Welcome back to New Vehicle Media, your go-to channel for EV stock. Quick reminder that subscribing's free and liking the video helps YouTube suggest similar content. Comments are loved and featured in upcoming videos. The new YouTube series was yet another surprise from the Californian startup. Thanks to the Tech Talk series for the first time, we'll be able to see what goes on behind the scenes at Lucid Air's excellent engineering facilities. Episode 1 of the series features CEO and CTO Peter Rawlinson, who showcased the Air's battery system by taking us through the goals for the project as well as its design, cooling, and wiring setups. To get viewers up to speed on the many terminologies and values that are important when developing the batteries for a breakthrough electric automobile, Rawlinson starts the tech chat with a short physics lesson, which induced the explanations of energy, power, kilowatts, joules, and other terms that you're probably used to hearing when talking about electric cars. Rawlinson presented it in such a credible fashion that even individuals who have no past understanding of batteries should be able to fully understand the fundamentals of how batteries, voltage, and thermal management systems function. Next, the Lucid CEO outlines what went into designing the battery that was ultimately used in the air, saying that the project's initial objective was for the air to have a 400-mile range. But then, thanks to some clever engineering and battery management, the air's range increased to 520 miles. The air makes use of 21,700 format battery cells, which are arranged into 300 cell modules for power. The longer range air sedans have 22 modules, while the shorter range ones have 18 and more space in the back for footroom. Having an extremely high voltage design for the air's battery pack was another of Lucid's objectives for the battery pack, since higher voltages allow for lower currents which lowers performance robbing heat loss. Lucid Air's cells are laid out in a way that optimizes passenger space compared to internal combustion-powered automobiles. Because of this, the battery pack is shaped around the passenger compartment in order to maximize space, and the battery modules are double-stacked between and beneath the rear bench in order to make the most of the otherwise unused space in many other auto designs. The battery enclosure construction offers structural stiffness and completes the passenger safety cell. The interesting thing is that the Lucid battery modules are literally positioned upside down in order to dissipate heat away from the drivers. They're further insulated by an 8mm thick ballistic screen made of epoxy composite which serves as the underfloor and rises towards the back of the vehicle in order to improve aerodynamic efficiency and protect the drivers and batteries. Rawlinson highlights Lucid's position as a Formula E battery supplier with the help of yet another eye-catching image before going on to discuss the pack's cooling mechanism in further detail. When it comes to battery-powered vehicles, cooling is critical, and the air can make use of its air conditioning system to enhance the built-in cooling system in each of its battery modules. Lucid's battery packs cool the ends of each cell rather than the sides of each cell, thanks to the use of a stamped aluminum framework to flow water glycol coolant. The sides of the round cells have a greater surface area to take unwanted heat away from, but Peter says that it's more difficult to maintain complete and constant contact with the sides of the circular cells. But 
in end-to-end -end cooling of the cells results in a flat surface and tighter cell spacing at the cost of somewhat increased module height. The choice to use this cooling solution, according to Rawlinson, was taken since it ensured consistency and cost efficiency over manufacturing runs that had reached into the millions of units. Lucid's proprietary wiring system for connecting cells and modules is then explained, and we get a peek at the battery management computer that is embedded into each of the company's modules as well. Lucid continues to improve their company and grow their fan following, despite the fact that many businesses have faced marketing challenges in the past. With this series focusing on their technology, they'll get a whole new fan base. Many people have never heard of Lucid or even seen one of their air sedans, which is understandable. Once more content creators are able to get their hands on a Lucid Air, the vehicle's popularity will undoubtedly continue to rise. All in all, this is an excellent series for consumers to discover more about Lucid Motors since YouTube has been used by many firms to enhance their reach and generate more exposure. Any business that is trying to establish a brand is absolutely crucial, but it's much more crucial in the automotive sector. With this new series, more individuals will have the opportunity to hear from Peter Rawlinson, the CEO and CTO of Lucid Group. The themes for the complete Tech Talk series have been released by Lucid, but not the dates on when they'll be broadcast. We'll keep a close eye out for them and make sure to share all of the episodes of the series as soon as they become available. If the rest of the series is even close to as informative and entertaining as the premiere episode was, you won't want to miss any of them. Stakeholders are thrilled that Lucid Motors and Peter Rawlinson will be hosting a series devoted to their technology. Many experts and investors are baffled by Lucid, and they should be studied by more technology analysts rather than automotive specialists. With the new series, Lucid can showcase their wonderful technology and maybe show off their incredible technology to potential partners who may be interested in partnering with Lucid. Peter Rawlinson mentioned once during the earnings report that Lucid is open to the possibility of forming a collaboration with a third party in order to license their battery technology. This series will be for the benefit of the customers and followers, as well as a fantastic opportunity to showcase their technology to prospective Silicon Valley or car legacy manufacturers that may be interested in entering the EV market in the future. But of course, I'm interested in knowing what you think. Do you think this series is Lucid's way of taking down the Shroud of Secrets? Let us know what you think by leaving a comment down below. Salim McCall says Lucid is number one in all aspects an EV should have, but it's too afraid to let people have a sneak peek into its claims. Well, guess what? Now they're giving out free lessons. That should wrap things up for today. Keep in mind that subscribing is still free and liking helps YouTube recognize your preferences. Thanks for taking the time to watch and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.